once again, good day to you. We've got a big variety of weather coming up, and as far as what's going to be affecting our weather as of 7 a.m., you can see across the Ohio Valley, a stationary front draped right across the Ohio. That's going to be the focus mechanism for the next 24 hours for showers and thunderstorms to develop. That'll lift northward as a warm front and usher in much warmer air into the area during the day Thursday and Thursday evening. Once that gets out of the way, we will have a storm system from the deep south move its way into the area. You might have heard of it, a little thing called Tropical Storm Sunday. We'll show you about the path on that in just a moment. Across the Ohio Valley at 7 a.m., you can see the temperatures. That stationary front across Ohio has become warm out here in Indiana and Illinois, so it is going to lift northward throughout the day on Thursday. And down to the south, here you have it near Houston, Texas, making landfall here directly as of Thursday morning. Tropical Storm Sunday, and that will take the following path. As you can see, it's highlighted with this yellow line the National Hurricane Center has provided for us. And you can see, eventually, it will end up over here towards eastern Kentucky. Now, if that moves a little further to the north, Along and to the north of the track, say 100 miles or so, is where the heaviest rainfall is going to take place. There will be some breezes with the 25, maybe gusting to 30 mile per hour. Nothing major unless you happen to get in a substantial amount of rainfall, which softens the soil quite a bit around the trees. Then you get some gusty winds, might knock a few small trees down. Nothing expected to be catastrophic for sure. Now, the travelers forecast that during the day Friday, not a good day to travel if you're thinking about it. Along and north of I, I always, I'd say US Route 30 or I-80, you're gonna have some thunderstorm activity, but along and south of that, the southern two thirds of Ohio is where your heaviest concentration of rainfall is going to take place because of the remnants of Tropical Storm Sunday. So just keep that in mind as you travel along. And you can see one thing here, temperatures are all pretty much bunched up together. You won't have a big variety in temperatures, and that typically happens when a tropical system moves its way through your area. With that in mind, let's take a look at the official National Weather Service five-day forecast. As you can see, we've been advertising it for the last couple of days. Much cooler conditions coming in at the beginning of next work week. Monday, a high of 71 degrees. <laughs> What's that all about? But you can bet on the other side of that high as it moves through, warmer air will return. Have yourselves a great weekend. Be wise, be alert, be safe out there with this uh, storm system moving through Friday. And uh, enjoy.